Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of What's Good and I went down to my local um, restaurant it's just down the street from me this is a, a local sandwich shop they I think they have one another one somewhere around here and it's been there for a little while and I've never tried it and I thought I would give it a try today and it's called the Americano it's a local sandwich shop and they have for lunchtime they have sandwiches cheese steaks um, burgers that and all that kind of thing and then later in the evening they switch over to a dinner menu where it's you know Italian Italian pastas lasagna um, all those different kind of dishes and I went for the lunchtime. I went. I wanted to try this sandwich. I've heard they're really good. They're a little bit pricey. The one that I got was called, it's called the King Kong. And it was $16, okay? That's a little bit, a little bit much for it. But what it is, is it's um, turkey, roast beef, and ham, jalapeno poppers, the Americana slaw and it's got the Godfather and the mob sauce and it's on a I had it on a sourdough roll you can get it on a lot of different ones and it's pretty good size and oh, yeah avocado as well so yeah it's turkey ham roast beef avocado jalapeno poppers mob sauce Godfather sauce and Americana slaw all in the in the roll and it's pretty good hefty guys okay so here we go this is what, what it is it's pretty good size and they cut it in half and here you go you can see the cross section it's got the the ham the turkey the jalapeno popper the avocado the roast beef the slaw and all that stuff and i'll work on this one half and like i said they had a um, regular like white wheat dutch crunch um, all those different. they had a whole lot of different sandwiches uh, maybe i'll put a picture of the menu up there <laughs> they had funny names a lot of them were like real real funny names and this is going to be messy tell that already all right Okay, here's half. Get that 360 view of it. And it's got the nice sourdough roll on it. And wow, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get all this in one bite or not, but here we go. This is King Kong. <laughs> King Kong sandwich, wow. All right. Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. Wow, that's got different sauces on it. That avocado, that popper. I had one of those poppers. Deep fried. A little bit of everything. Wow. The ham is really good. The turkey. And the roast beef and the the sandwich is um is nice and the bread's nice and crunchy from that because it's a uh, like a sourdough roll and the different sauces are pretty good it's like a one's a mob sauce and one's a godfather sauce and i don't know what um what, what flavors they are but the the sauces on there are really good it's going again, guys. See if I can get one more bite. Hmm. Mm. <coughs> wow. Mm. That's really good, guys. Um. Wow. <laughs> and like I said, they've only been here for a little time. They've just been down the street for a little bit. And... I always think about going there, but I never do because 
they only have lunch from like uh i think it's like 11 o'clock till about like 3 30 or 4 then they switch over to the dinner menu so you kind of have to go in the daytime but um it is a little pricey but it's really good i don't know if i would get this particular combination again but they have all the different kinds the cheese steaks all the other ones but this one certainly is a good a good sandwich <laughs> and it's got quite big and like i said this is just half of it so i don't know maybe i'll have the other half for dinner but one more bite guys here we go mm. <laughs> mm. wow roast beef cheese provolone they all the sauces blend well together that meat certainly piled high. That slaw kind of makes it nice and moist. It's not it's not a dry sandwich at all with all the sauce, the slaw, the poppers are kind of a nice surprise. And wow, I don't know. So for this one from Americano sandwich, Italian sandwich, definitely gonna have to give this one 11 out of 11. This A phenomenal sandwich. Now, I'm sure that all their other sandwiches that they have on the menu would be um, just as good with the quality meats, just a little different. But they also have the base sauces, the Godfather, the mob sauce. Some of them have one, some of them have the other. Or you can build your own sandwich. They have an option where you can just tell them what you want on it. You want the different meats, you want the um, poppers, the avocado, you know, you name it, they have it. They had the meatballs, they have pastrami, all kinds of different ones. But I, I thought this one sounded interesting. And I guess King Kong refers to the size of it and then it's got everything in it. So definitely would try this one again if I go back or perhaps I'd try another one. So if you have a local sandwich shop in your area, maybe go and give them a try. Sometimes the... Um, the local ones, the mom and pop kind of stores, they're hidden, hidden gems that uh, you just can't find elsewhere. And again, I will probably be trying this sometime later. Maybe I'll put a picture if I ever try another, another sandwich, or maybe I'll do another review. Who knows? But anyways, I thought I would give this one a try. And I like to go to the places that are local to me because I like to support my community. And I'm always looking for something that's um, unique to my area and it has good food and i know sometimes you know all the old uh, fast food places the mcdonald's all those other stuff i mean they have all their stuff they have all their dishes and their new releases and stuff but uh, once in a while i like to go and see what's around in my community and check it out and this one's definitely one of the good ones so it's been another episode of what's good and certainly this one was good in my community. I have to try and find another one another time. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification button right over there. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I will be trying something good and local for you guys out there, I am going to finish this, at least this half off. And I'll talk to you later.